to the cabinet member, Councillor Davies. Uh, now the Blacker Road uh, element. Of six. six. <laughs> now the Blacker Road elements of the A629 widening proposals have been cancelled. What will the council tell residents who are due to lose homes and gardens and parts of their gardens? Councillor Simpson. Oh, sorry. Just a minute. Okay. Thank you. Martin, I'm going to use a little comment you made earlier. Thank you, Councillor Bird. Um, now the Blackie Road element, and then your question. The Blackie Road element is paused, not cancelled. And you, we mentioned the shadism earlier on about the Eggman White Baths. It's been a long time, it's been paused a very long time. The council has engaged with the affected residents and businesses throughout the development of the scheme and will continue to do so on an individual basis as appropriate. We will engage with landowners on a case-by-case -case basis to agree next steps to the program. Councillor Cooper, do you have a supplementary question? I do. Um, pause. Here's the Oxford uh, English Dictionary. And, and to pause is to, um, is to stop briefly, then recommence. So is the pause one day? Is it two days? Is it a week? Is it a month? Is it a year? Is it two years? And is it actually fair to the people whose lives are on hold, the people who've been, uh, who, who could potentially lose their homes, the people who could lose their gardens to keep them in limbo all this time? Is the council doing, its, doing, its, doing the right thing by those people by just saying, we're hang leaving this hanging in the air. Aren't we letting those people down? Shouldn't we be telling those people exactly what's going to happen to them about their future in the places that they live? Councillor Verd. The council are aware of the uncertainty uh, resulting from the inflation review, review undertaken by Wicca, another mayoral authority. And we'll work closely with the Mayor Brabin and her colleagues to ensure commitments to the rest of the transport programme. We will work, we will continue to work with those individuals that you mentioned going forward. Thank you, Councillor Verd. Uh, 